Good morning, Half Moon Bay High School. I'm Kaylee, and this is the Cougar Campus News. Students, are you interested in working with kids on homework help? Cunha School has an after-school program on Tuesdays, and they are looking for high school students to help with tutoring for all subjects. You will earn community service hours for your time. This is a great way to give back to the community and help our fellow Cubs. Please see Ms. Baker in G10 for more details, or email the counselor, Janice Lee, at Cunha at the email address below. Half Moon Bay FFA is hosting a toy, book, and canned food drive to kick off this holiday season. Donated toys will need to be new and unwrapped, books will need to be new or gently used, and canned food will need to be unexpired. Donations can be dropped off in room K6 until Friday. Now, let's enjoy this special video as our very own Miss Baker hosted her fourth annual Baker's Baker Cookie Exchange for all her math students. Okay, so Diana and Maya, runners up. Diana, what did you bring today for us? I brought M&M cookies. And you said that in your country, it's not a common thing to make, right? No. So is that your first time? No. Portugal doesn't have chocolate cookies. So. No. But it, so it was your first time making those? Yeah. How'd that go? I think it was good. Do you think you'll bring that recipe home to your family? Um, sure. Yeah? Do you guys use butter or olive oil? Or both? Butter. Depends on the okay. recipe. Yeah. Okay. And then Maya, what did you bring over here? Cheese cookies. Yes, all different kinds. Yum. Well, thank you. Is that like your family recipe or you just liked it? <gasps> Perfect. Okay, well, thank you. Oh, Our first place winners, we, we Jennifer are first and place. Susie. Oh, so the cookie contest. I'm yes. Susie Tomasella. I'm Jenna. And what kind of cookie did you make? Chocolate chip. The um, best one. It's pretty basic. You cannot go wrong with a chocolate chip. You literally cannot go wrong. Can, go can wrong. I open it? Oh, please. Let's see the it's, inside. Okay. So it's kind of soft. Nice. Oh, it's nice. It's soft. Awful. Some great texture. Yes. Perfect. It melts in your mouth. Just. It's honestly And what amazing. were you doing this for? What's going on? Um, Baker. Baker's Baking Contest. Yeah. There you number go. one. Okay. We won number one. We yes. Won. We need to de-stress for finals. We okay. We each got a sock. She gets a sock. <laughs> and I get a sock. She gets a sock. Happy holidays. And we share. Sharing is caring. Thank oh, you. I brought a snickerdoodle. With a fancy one. Yeah, with like melted chocolate on top and sprinkles. Very pretty. Thank you. And our first place winner for this year's fourth annual is Miss Chloe over here. Chloe brought. Yep. All right, congratulations. Good job, everybody. Thank you. Hey Cougars, you're almost at the finish line. Winter break is just around the corner and you have 18 whole days. That's 432 hours. Who figures out this stuff? Anyway, you have 432 hours of vacation time where you're not here at school. So why not take advantage of all those hours and get your community service hours in? Seniors, this is your longest break before the end of your senior year. So, if you still need some hours, take advantage of many opportunities during the winter break. You'll thank yourself next semester when you're not backed up against the wall as the springtime approaches. So here are a couple of options. If you like to be outdoors, I mean, who doesn't like being outside? Although it's been kind of cold out, right? So if you like being outside doing physical work in a beautiful setting, or if you just simply like playing around with animals, hey, who doesn't like a dog or a cat or a horse or even a cow, then sign up with Vita Verde. It's possible to earn 40 hours volunteering just five days with them this break, and you'd be completely finished with your service hours. Or if you like to be indoors in this cold weather, and you like technology, volunteer at the Half Moon Bay Library in their maker space. No need to be an expert, you'll be trained in all the maker technologies and in robot repair work. Pretty cool, huh? They're open every day, so again, you can earn all your required service hours during break. 
For another outdoor manual labor opportunity, volunteer with Big Wave, located right by the HMB airport. Help them plant wetlands, cut willow stock, and spread seed. There's lots more ways to give back to our local nonprofits and earn some service hours by scanning that service QR code. You see them around campus. Look for the link to winter break opportunities on the first page. And don't forget, each service day gets its own separate log. So make sure you carefully type in the correct email for your supervisor and then include a detailed description of exactly what you did to earn those hours. Okay, Cougars. Do your best on your final exams. Sign up to volunteer, get those hours banged out, and have a tremendous winter break. In the final game of the Burlingame Tournament, the boys' varsity basketball team busted out of their shooting slump with a convincing 84-58 victory over Pioneer High School. Dio Lucido had a career-high 26 points. Gio Garduno Martin, added 19 points, three steals, and three assists. And Drew Dorwin scored 18 points and had seven steals. The Cougars go on the road to face Sarah High School on December 23rd.